Hello and welcome to the highly requested, wait for it. Alto Mona Lisa. Oh yeah, finally, we're doing it. And um, yes, we're starting at part two. Why? Because Hectix Gaming has invited us to um, sort of do a uh, how do you, how do you call it? It's not really a co-op let's play. It's more like past the parcel, past the controller, but online. Um, what's going to happen is he's done part one and explained the rules already. So if you go to the Hectix Gaming channel, which is will be a link in the description, uh, head on over there and you'll watch the first episode and you, you'll get the gist of what's going on, and then come back and this is episode two. So yes, yeah, um, well, all we've agreed on is that we're using the Mustang as our first car um, because the, this is the American version. We're using the the same version of the game, so this actually works. Uh, I've never played the American version of the game. I've got the European version, which doesn't have like Dodge or Ford. I don't think it has Hyundai either. I don't know, why do you want to use a Hyundai in this game? No idea. Um, but yeah, see what he's done to this Mustang. Let's have a look here. Oh my... <laughs> All I saw was the logo that says dead. Does that say found on road dead? It does, it says found on road dead. Oh my god. I love it. I love the kit as well. It's full. Is this full Cobra R kit? No plate though. We're gonna have to change that. Obviously, uh, with most things we do, there will be some pranks. There will be a bit of back and forth. See, so, yeah, there. There's our Mustang. I'm gonna do um, the tune car. Yes, dress up. I'm gonna do a, qu a quick something. Where's a uh, sort of parts? See, Hectix is not like three-spoke wheels uh, for some some reason. Don't know why. I think it's normal. Um, so what I'm gonna do is just put some three spokes on. Um, make an ad van. There we go. Oh yeah. Go for these ones. There we go. Blue because it's a Ford, and. Um, that's gonna stay. And the plate I'll only change to. Wait, how oh, how's it even work? I guess you pick a letter and you Ah, okay. Right. I'm gonna write. Where's the numbers? Do we get numbers? There's numbers. Can I write free spoke for the win? without it cutting off. This is a bit... Ah, no. I can write free Spock. Free Spock will do. You know what? Three Spock will do. Yes, it's not a three Spock. A tiny ass plate. Five digits. Right. Let's see our specs here. Tune up parts. It was done. A tender slip. Good choice. No turbo, racing muffler. I think I think it's left a, a good car for us. So we'll leave that until we come back from the race. So the idea is we have the championship each um, until sort of until he's on level one, obviously, and do level two. Oh, hold on. Ah, I see. Okay. So I've got four races to do, uh, starting with the Akaki downhill. And I'm gonna use well, I'm gonna use auto because I'm a noob at this game. I'll admit it, I'm a massive noob at this game. I used to use a 22 beam and just bounce off walls. Uh, but I'm gonna try and do a championship on episode until sort of later on when we do like half a championship each. Let's see, see how it goes. Um, I'm hoping my controls are configured for this properly. One of his triangle is hazard lights. And one of these, there we go, this one's in the front view. Free Spock. Sick. I love the S95 Mustangs. Oh my god, this car handle's so twitchy. It might be my controls. I'm getting destroyed. What the hell's going on here? Why am I getting roasted? What's Hectic done to this car? Why is it so slow? I'm fully blaming Hectic for this. Oh, man, I spun it. On the restart, um, clearly 
something's wrong with this car. Let's go back and uh, have a look at the actual parts. Right. We... Oh. Yeah, we have slipped. I think. I think that's what we have, right? Yeah, it's the one that's selected, so that's what we've got. So, we've got racing brakes, setting. You can set your brakes to max speed? Oh, I see. Um, the brakes are really quite twitchy, but I'll have like front bias just because it makes it a bit easier to drive. Um, so the suspension. Hard. Well, maybe that's the issue. Maybe medium's better. Ooh, Olin's. Good brand there. No turbo for this car. Racing muffler, ROM. Ah, ROM's a secret. Engine swap's also a secret. Gearbox. Top gear ratio. Ah, okay. Ter uh, okay. I see all the Oh, I'm actually on. We'll take it to the middle, I think. It's the that way. I'm just winging it, you know, you know me. I'm winging it a little bit. I just got decimated. I'm just thinking. Oh, don't, don't quit. Still working my way through menus. Right, let's try this again. Uh, oh, apparently they've got difficult ratings. So we'll do this one first. <laughs> Because it's easier. We'll do the easy one first and work way out, our way up. I think Uroko is like, you know, hard on purpose. Alright, we're doing West Tokyo. We're going to Civics. And see, we got blown away by Civics and Mazda 6s. And the an MX5. An, an NB MX5. It's not even like an NA. I think it's way too short geared still. Why is it twitchy, damn? I might have like, suck a... I don't know, a dead zone or something with my controller, because this is... Oh god. Griffin Mustang. Let's start the uh, Mustang week counter up. A second since last crash. I think 18 fourth gear. It's very short geared. Quick though. Can I pass Hector in his Civic? 130, I don't want to break. I'm gonna have to slowly tweak this car until it behaves itself. I think change suspension to medium has helped a lot. Ooh. I've literally just like reconfigured my PCX2 as well. So <laughs> the controller being this twitchy was not a problem before. And I've not played this game, you know, recently enough to know if this is actually how it is or if uh, it's my settings. I'm using like a, an Xbox One pad that's wired. So. I don't know, we'll see. I mean, it's fine on other games which aren't emulators. Usual BGC fashion, we'll fix it as we go. With tips from the community. community. Uh, so making our way downtown Tokyo. This is much better than the Toge. We got absolutely destroyed. I like the fact there's a Civic just on my ass the whole time. God damn. See, because we're in Japan, we're the import punk. And they're the domestics. Weird turn of events. What would the exotic be in this case? There's no, like... There's no European brand in this game. Which I always thought was, you know, I, you know, I know it's a Japanese game, we'd have Japanese manufacturers, but I thought like maybe BMW or Mercedes at least, you know, like, because they're usually quite popular in Japan. Oh my god, that's if we just. That's VTEC for you, that's absolutely VTEC. 
last two corners I don't don't win my race now Civic oh no oh he just oh my god luckily he screwed up before I did so there we go hella twitchy this car but it'll do uh, EK9 was behind me EG6 they got Tiburon that we didn't notice nice Right, I will now work out how to <laughs> get out the replay. Uh, ah, there you go. <clears throat> okay, next race. Oh, a gold trophy for that. Uh, engine tune stage two. Ah! Michelin poster, air compressor, a sticker, I have mail. You have mail. Right, let's. let's Beef them up a little bit. I've got it's actually a thing in this game where you unlock the parts per race. So, motor stage two. We're now on 369. Nice horsepower. And I'm going to up the gear ratio a little bit more. Move to five. And I'm happy with the rest. We're getting there. Our Mustang's getting there. Right, let's continue with the racing. Level 2. Somehow way more difficult than I remember. Um, this one's Tokyo Rain. Is second hardest difficult. Uh, second easiest, sorry. We'll leave, we'll leave the mountain pass till last. We're going to sort of graduate onto the mountains, you see. Got the same crew. Yet again. Different colours, though. I'll have the sticker. I'm, I'm going to have to change it. I need to troll heck bits of this sticker. We've trolled Ford fans, now we have to troll each other. Ooh, it's still short geared though. I'm doing, I'm doing like, I'm 18 fourth still. It's geared like a single cam Honda. Like where you do 19 fourth gear. And a fifth just for maximum speed. Oh, I'm so glad I fixed the brakes though. He doesn't want to swap ends on me now. Is that tip going up ahead? I'm good it is. NFSU vibes. Currently third. Past the EG. It's a yellow EG. And found the EK9. I'm gonna back off a little bit. Oh my god, he brake checked me. What did he do? Did he just throw an anchor out or something? Nah, I'm putting a more my civic middle of the road here. And it's raining, but it's not that bad. Come on. I need anchors. <laughs> That's close. Oh, I'm going. I'm lost in Tokyo. Damn. This game, I have to say, scales up so well. On P all right, so it sells shaded, obviously. Um, I've noticed if Road Trip Adventure as well, they age so well because. Obviously on PS2 it looks quite jaggy and you know you have to play it on HDMI now and it doesn't look as good as it did on old CRT TV back in the 90s. But on an emulator it just looks so sharp like this would pass right now for a new game and I would play the shit out of it. Same road trip because that's on a PS3 as a port. It is a lot sharper. Like, oh, I've got my view is set to right trigger, which is very sensitive. You know, when you put it on like modern systems, they just look so good. And the whole like, oh, it looks bad, how do I, how do I play this back in the day, doesn't apply. Because this looks more clear than like, some, you know, modern games. There we go, easy. It wasn't easy, it was very difficult, but I'm getting there. I didn't know this was called the IFA FIP 4 Mustang. <laughs> what chassis code is that, Ford? IFA FIP. Ford's an SN95. Right, we've got weight reduction, uh, more posters, a gas tank, poster, poster, Toby poster. Snap on, more stickers, more mail. 
Okay, we need we need weight reduction because obviously this is a problem. Oh, I've got level three now. But we will do that. Well, Hectic will do that. Unless he wants to you know, half do it. Um, yeah, tune car. Let's get some weight reduction. This car's fat. Uh, 3,200 pounds. I don't know how much that, that is in kilo. Uh, I just know 2,200 is 1,000, so 1,500 kilo, I think. Uh, Showing about 100 kilo off. 100 pounds off, sorry. 100 kilo, that'd be, a lot. that'd be good. I'm going to check the mail while we're out here. Where's the mail? Mail. Oh. Do you know what? No. That is, um... That, that is just offensive. I'm not getting emails about my driving. I'm not reading that. Right, so. US Dirt Track. Oh, I don't remember that. High speed, apparently. Did 43. Let's go race. Let's see, uh... <laughs> is that actually a dirt track? I want to see it. I want to see this. I don't... This must be a US exclusive thing. Oh my god, it is. This was not on the uh, European release. I have slicks. This isn't going to go well. I was literally an oval. <laughs> of course, the first US track we go on, and it's just dirt NASCAR. I am Doc Hudson. Oh my god, I'm just literally sliding all over the place. Why am I using slicks? Oh my god, oh my god. My controller vibrates so much. How many laps is three? That's fine. Oh, we got them on straight. That's good. On the corner? Oh my. <laughs> it feels like doing super speedway on Gran Turismo 3 with an Escudo with no tyres. It just slides everywhere. I'll tell you what though, obviously American cars winning this. Just basically NASCAR. Oh my god, I'm basically wall- Oh my god. That's a wall tap. It's now a drift Mustang. We got it though, we got this. Um, turn my hazards on though, because... Why am I controlling? Oh my god, I hope you guys can hear this. My controller's going absolutely mad. It's just, um... Rattling its poor guts out. This controller's like, been with me, I think, for about three years now. And, um... It's had a rough life. M many an hour. Playing games like... Forza, Gran Turismo. Not Gran Turismo, what am I saying? GTA, what I meant. Gran Turismo. I wish I could play Gran Turismo with this. I suppose I could if I put, put the game in this. The little emulator. That'd be an idea actually, playing Gran Turismo 2 on an emulator. So my save won't fucking corrupt. I think I lost like something like 10 Gran Turismo 2 saves over the years. And so I was like, I'm going to stop playing this. I'm going to play Grand Tomo 1 instead. And my OG save for Grand Tomo 1 still works. To this day. And it's been like, what, 20 years? More? I've got to find my copy of Grand Tomo 1 somewhere. If I still have it. And has my game just froze? Don't tell me you froze. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Heart attack. This guy's an auto save. Right. Computer tuning, finally. Uh, Penswell sign. A helmet? Not for me though. Alright. We've literally only got Urarocco left. So. I'm happy with the car. We're gonna. Oh my god, it's doing this thing again. I don't think the game is happy <laughs> being emulated currently. That's fine. You know what? It's fine. As long as it works eventually, it's all good. Alright. Computer level 1. A remap has given us 8 horsepower. Uh, let's see. Go for a blitz. A blitz tune. So before we do anything, I'm going to save it. Um, just because 
these grey screens of death are worrying me. Wait, that's saving the car. Is it? Mustang. Great. <laughs> I mean, I suppose saving the garage saves the game? I don't know. I don't know. This game is so alien to me, like, what, 15 years later? I don't know how old this game is the, anymore. Right, oh, Sakagi, not Oroko. What's in Oroko? Is that like the previous one? Uh, yeah, it is. Alright. We're on a Kagi, sorry. My bad. Right, pray for me because obviously at the beginning of this video we tried and absolutely failed miserably. This is a zero to hero hour. I'm gonna do it. Three spokes on hand. Oh my god. Had the zone. Oh my god. Destroy us from the start. Is that Ikitani 13 in front of there? Right. Oh god, I'm hitting walls. Ah, uh, stop that. Right, need to concentrate. And spin. You know what? We're not winning this. <laughs> oh no. I am not a good driver in this game. Jeez. I'm six seconds behind and my car keeps spinning. I can't do this. <laughs> Uh, do we still like get to advance if I just suck at this? Oh, I'm catching someone though. Is it the MX-5? No, it's an EG. Is it Shingo? It's Shingo. It's Freddy G. Come here, Shingo. Oh. Oh. There you go. It's not embarrassing if it's double crash. There you go, I'm third currently. <laughs> I'm third, there we go. I wonder if I can actually catch up though. I'm catching someone again. Ooh, is that, is that the EK? You just phased in and out of existence. Is this fifth stage all of a sudden? But it's not yellow. And that's fourth stage. Oh, anchor's on again. Hey, I even caught Ikatani. He's probably on his way to see Mako. And I'm about to ruin it. I'm about to end this man's hole. Oh my god, backfire. I can see it from space. I'm gonna hunt you down. I'm gonna hunt you down and kill you. Oh, you break way too high for that corner. Oh, that was a good overtake. If I do say so myself. Oh, I think I think we've done it. If we can stay ahead, we've overcome a. S oh my shit! You know what? Oh my, I'm third. Oh, hold on, we're not that quick. We've overcome a six-second gap for this. I'm not going to lose it now. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. No, don't hit the Let's be friends. Down the inside. Oh, I break way too early like them. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, that was clutch. Free Spock has done it. Oh, the if I fit Mustang GT. Just took it. That's a six second, like, handicap that I overcame. There we go. That's it, level two is now done. Ooh, error parts was added to all the cars. Donald Retro sign and radio. Ooh. Let's, uh,. Let's try and not rice out a Mustang. How about that? I didn't get anything tuna, we didn't get any tuna parts, did we? Dress up. Aero. 
let's see. Oh, we got some. Hmm. Do I want this? I think I do. I put some straps in it, we can't really see it yet. Let's see. Oh. That's just the first model hood. Yeah, 2000 Cobra R hood. It even says, that's cool. Uh, we'll keep the Cobra R hood. What about mirrors? What do they have for mirrors? Why are they red? Unless they <laughs> aren't red mirrors, it looks funny. Um, oh my god. I almost want to, but mm, it's a bit too, too much. Um, ooh. I have to say, I like that one. Go to the back here. What the kits do we have? A diffuser? That looks good. And a wing. Go for a wing. A xenon wing. Looks like a ducktail. And no wing. Uh, I'll keep the Cobra R wing. Keeping those, obviously. Has he tinted the headlights? He has. Make look angry. Nah. Keep him tinted. Right. Now, paint. Ah, okay. What I'm going to do is do the paint and the uh, logo on a little time lapse. It's going to take a while. So I'll be right back. Right, so no time lapse, uh, just because I fumbled with the uh, sticker maker for quite a while. <laughs> it didn't go very well. Um, so I just. I made something else, shall we say. Um, I found enough trolling, I think, with three spokes. So I thought I'd do something else. That'd be nice with the uh, big logo. So whoever at Capcom made this as a sample sticker, you are a pixel art legend. Um, but yeah, I just added names. Uh, so Hectix is the blue head guy. Uh, BGC, which is me, uh, is the sort of green, light green haired girl. I think that's quite fitting. I want to see the reaction to that. I want, to, I want him to think that I've made that pixel by pixel. And I hope, hope he has what he, uh, that's what he ends up believing. And add the change of plate. BGC number one. Had to. Uh, Ford logo on the bumper, so you know what's hit you. On the side, the anime again with Haveline uh, oil, obviously. Alpine, good stereos, and Olin suspension we're using. I changed the silver three spokes just to stand out a bit better against the purple. And on the back, another Ford logo, another anime logo, and Falcon on the rear spoiler, which doesn't. Uh, it doesn't really come out great, but it can stay, because you won't see it anyway. Uh, so yeah, there is pretty much... Oh, of course, it's beauty purple. Oh, how could I forget? We were white stripe, which we had earlier. Uh, yeah, how could I forget that? This is a, a slick-looking car now. <clears throat> so, um... I'd say see you next time, but actually, go to Hectic's Hex channel and um, sub to him because part three will be out on his channel and then after that you have to come back here for part four um, I don't know how this will work out <laughs> bit, but I think it will I think it's, you know, it's, it's a change of pace I guess and uh, since the emulator works again who knows what else I'll play you know uh, check the mail again before we go Tuning, driving, so I don't need any of this. I'm a god, I don't need any of this. Right, so yeah. Uh, if you come here from Techadix channel, uh, welcome, by the way. Bit late, but welcome. I <laughs> uh, hope you stick around. And yeah, that's it. So thanks all, and goodbye. Shout out to Tyler4987.